Hey guys, welcome to the Grizzled Beagle playthrough. This is Kreslov. This is Dookie Dingo. And this is Johnson. And we are back after our short hiatus due to lots and lots and lots and lots and lots and lots of school. Mm -hmm. And Both then we failed Johnson everything. And I had <laughs> well, I believe uh, I'm done. Uh, Johnson, are you done with school, Dad? Uh, I I am on a break between semesters. I uh, we will be presenting my thesis and uh, defending my thesis and doing my last classwork over the summer. Nice, and I think Dingo's thinking about going back to school, so all of us are doing school things, hurrah. Well, the basic idea is, and this is probably why we're friends with each other, on average, we have a higher IQ than you, the viewer. We're simply smarter people. <laughs> wow. Wow. <laughs> okay. Some hostility yeah, that's... there, Johnson. <laughs> yeah, I just want them to know a... what we really think of them. Just want to let them know what the score is. So hey, while you're you sitting here watching me. YouTube videos, we're bettering our lives. So suck that. Well, oh no, you this guys is gonna put me did. The I mean, you guys. Oh, did. I, I had nothing to do with it. I'm. I'm not bettering my life. I'm not making anything better at all. <laughs> He's getting on the level of the viewer. <laughs> he wants to live among them. Can, so can, what, can what are we doing? doing? I don't know. Johnson is just running around like a madman here. Oh, I was waiting for you to get in. I just realized you're inside. Well, yeah, you're uh, mission man. Tell me where to go. We have something yeah, to turn in. We said. have something to turn in at uh, Sanctuary. Oh, we should or probably teleport them. We can go. No, hold on. Uh, wildlife Exploitation Preserve is next. Ah, uh, no, not the Wildlife Exploitation Preserve. Yep, Wildlife Exploitation. So we should probably go do that. Just, All right. Uh, uh, yeah, what's the easiest way it. to access it? Um, <laughs> there's a teleport. There's a teleport overlook. If you want to go to overlook. Well, no. There's a teleport right where we came in. Yeah, there should be one here. I don't want. That's a dirty teleporter. <laughs> here, All right. Well, you use that one. I'll go use a different one. <laughs> I just don't know if we actually have the Tiberium Bridge. Really? <laughs> I died. I tried to help Johnson out. I died a little. Oh, but Johnson oh, is down. <laughs> but re okay. This is going great. This is just going fantastic. I'm respawning. All right, now you can go. For some reason, for some reason, I remember us giving each other grief over random things. <laughs> Griefing. What? It's what that never video happens. Video gaming is everything. Is that what this let's play? Video was games about? are all about. Why did we teleport? Look, you just get where back did, in the car, go? get back in the car, and we have to go Why are we still through on the, the island? <laughs> Because that's where thought, we have to go. I thought we had to turn in something in sanctuary. Just, just get just just get in. <laughs> he drove off without me. Use the, I thought use we had the something teleporter. To turn in. We do, it's okay though. It's not exactly like it's a huge deal. It's no, just some, it's, it's, it's some optional radio. mission for Tannis. <laughs> some optional mission for Tannis. Nobody cares about Tannis. Tannis doesn't even care about Tannis. Uh, I I feel upset and and great distress over us not completing things in order. Oh, they completed. We just didn't turn them in. They're not complete until they're turned in. Right. Ah, <laughs> oh, here we are. Oh, here we are. <laughs> Until then, you're just See, a dirty you. liar. It's fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. Everything Nothing is, is terrible. Awful. Everything's great. Everything is awful. Yeah, everything is awful. These shields are terrible. You know, I, I think I think we're missing something here. And that something What's is that? Worthington. <laughs> oh, I forgot about him. We need more Worthington all the time. It's kind of like picking up a TV <laughs> show right. you hadn't watched in a while, and you're like, oh, I remember that character. I don't like that character. <laughs> Are you calling Worthington a character? <laughs> he is a character. That guy is a card. So Worthington is a demigod, is what Worthington is. <laughs> 
That's actually fair and accurate. I mean, it's... He might as well be in comparison to everything. I mean, everybody's probably scared to death of the guy. I want to see Worthington as a regular on Big Bang Theory. <laughs> That'd be a lot more death than Big Bang Theory. <laughs> yeah. Well, everything went better than expected. <laughs> it's Worthington. It's Worthington. These are glowing mushrooms You're right. with spikes. Yeah. <laughs> You're right, Worthington deserves his own sitcom. Would it be like a buddy cop drama, or what? It's a buddy cop drama, but the buddy always changes, because he slaughters him at the end of each episode. <laughs> so every episode's oh. a new buddy. <laughs> and the chief every time is like, Worthington! <laughs> You've got to be kidding! <laughs> then they have to do that thing from, uh... They have to do that thing from, what is it, Naked Gun? Or no, Police Squad, the thing from Police Squad, where everybody freezes except for that one person. <laughs> that one person is Worthington as he continues to and slaughter And he just kills everybody, <laughs> yeah. The first episode is in the first few minutes, the chief is like, Worthington, this is your new partner, show him the ropes. And immediately he's slashed to pieces in the office, like he doesn't even get... He doesn't even get out the door. And there's just shreds of him everywhere, and he's like, Worthington, we've been over this. You're suspended. Yeah, now I have to get another new desk. <laughs> Turn in your badge, Worthington. <laughs> and then he kiss slashes the, <laughs> the chief's arm off. And the chief is like, you're back huh. on the force. <laughs> where are we going? I can't even see where to go. Everything looks the same. It is all the same. I'm talking to Mordecai right now. Oh, I want to talk to Mordecai. How'd you get up there? Sir. We, we didn't take the turn. We didn't take the turn. Oh, okay. take the turn. I was killing things. You know, that's usually what you do in Borderlands, but... I guess this Wrong time we can, turn. we can talk to people instead. <laughs> Why would we do that? There, I talked to... We have to infiltrate the, the shipping yard. He's got Bloodwing, <laughs> holding prisoner. Her. Bloodwing is a female. I didn't say he. Oh, wait, yes, I did. <laughs> I said holding him. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't listening holding to my own words. Prisoner. The end. <laughs> Everyone knows that birds are asexual. <laughs> Just not interested you mean in their production. Not? Hey, Bird, you want to have sex? <laughs> nah, I'm good. <laughs> Birds divide like cells. <laughs> bird mitosis. And with one bird great tosis. call, the crow was two. <laughs> with great call comes great responsibility. Uh, I think you're getting your... I think you're getting your animals mixed up. <laughs> Quote the raven, I reproduce asexually. <laughs> That was during Edgar Allan Poe's weird phase. <laughs> you mean his entire life? <laughs> his normal phase was brief. <laughs> it was during the fifth grade. That was it. <laughs> for like a week. The, the normal phase was between the first and third trimester. <laughs> That's called the second trimester, Kressel. <laughs> Look you. Let's not get technical. You're counting. I like getting technical. It helps me argue about things. <laughs> well, technically. <laughs> Can you define technical? We need an exact definition of technical. Uh, things that, uh... Look, I would do... Oh, we're just need to just hurt be... them. Oh. Oh, that's it? I've been slaughtering. Man, I should really look at the mission. <laughs> yeah, we've just been murdering them. <laughs> You gotta, you gotta shoot off limbs. Well, I, we, I How do you use it this? I'm too strong. <laughs> I'm too powerful. Okay, I shot one's limb off. This is actually legitimately difficult because of how strong we are. <laughs> Alright, he got another one. <laughs> okay, we have two. We just need to do one more. Here, one just came down. There we go. Okay, I can kill that one then. Alright, now we can kill all of them. <laughs> Hooray? <laughs> Now, now I can slaughter them like the pigs they are. 
That's been my Burn goal all along. It's fine. Crush the enemy. See them driven before you. Rejoice in the lamentations of their women. They're robots. They reproduce asexually. <laughs> are you saying that all birds are robots, or all robots are birds? <laughs> I, I, I get on board with that. Which one? <laughs> Both oh, of them. How else, can you, how else can you explain birds flying other than they're robots? Seriously. things can't fly. <laughs> Why it is impossible. <laughs> that re Chris, that reminds me of, uh, that reminds me of, um, an improv sketch that we did one time. It's like, I told you birds was magic! Oh, jeez, that, little... That's not an improv skit that we did, Dingo. That was a SNL sketch. What? No, we, you had one where you, uh... No, you had one... You were with... Save me. The little one got me. No, you, we, we did that... We no, did that, that in a... That uh, an SN, we, we did I'm that in an improv sure that's sketch. That's an SNL sketch. I don't remember that. And you stole I think it. I remember saying that on SNL. I, no, I you never said that. said that in an improv sketch. You did. I have never said that in an improv sketch. That, that <laughs> definitely happened in an improv sketch. I am 99.85% like certain that happened in an improv sketch. So, panelists, the question is, did this happen in an improv sketch? Discuss. <laughs> well, only people that went to our college would know for certain. Or if they've watched every episode of SNL. And nobody watches SNL. <laughs> <laughs> that is true. It's been it's been terrible. No, some years. people watch it. You want to know who watches it? People who love Saturday night commercials. They have to watch it to get to them. People who <laughs> really like smarmy, self righteous liberal BS. The best thing to come out of SNL in the past few years has been Andy Samberg. Define smarmy, because I love the word, and I'm actually a little unclear on its exact meaning. <laughs> um, imagine something that's been smarmed. <laughs> no, no, just still struggling. Still struggling. <laughs> um, Everyone knows to properly so define the word, you have to use it in the definition. That's true. Yeah, I mean that's that's English. That's English. Smarmy, effectively, thoroughly smarmed. <laughs> <laughs> well, have you, ever, have you ever had a conversation with somebody, and you just walked away, kind of feeling gross? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's why oh, I had yes, smarmy to be. It's like, oh, he's smarmed all over me. Ah, oh, he got. Ah, oh, I've just been smarmed. <laughs> every every time I talk to this guy named Jerry, and he smears pudding on my face. <laughs> I walk away from that conversation feeling very just dirty. A, he's a smarmy guy. So then I look up smarmed. Hey, you guys are forgetting the. Uh, you guys are forgetting that special thing. Smash the, the fuse box. The teddy bear. Oh, no, yeah, where is the teddy bear? I don't care about it? teddy bears. It's down here. The what, teddy, teddy bear. bear? Yeah. No, I was talking about this. Uh, I was talking about this weapons chest that you have to smash the fuse box for. It doesn't matter. These weapons are going to be woefully underpowered for us. But yeah, those are those are smarmy weapons. Counts. These weapons <laughs> smarm all over the place. I don't like it. I'm sensing some judgment from my definition of smarmy. I'm not entirely sure I appreciate it. Where do we? <laughs> I don't think there's been a definition of smarmy given at all. It's still a mystery to me. That uh, actually makes the word more fun, because I really am not, I mean, honestly, icky is probably a good way to say it. You know, it's icky, it's shady, sleazy. Well, I, I don't think of it necessarily as sleazy. I think of it as, like, maybe self-righteous. Smart me, um, self-righteous. Smug. 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 Um, I, can, I can see that. I can see smug. Oh, we have to go down here, by the way. We have to go into the, the cage. <laughs> oh, I was getting the teddy bear. I don't know what teddy bear you're referring to, but okay. Show me. Uh, Show me, the cage, gents. Teach me about the teddy well, bear. We're gonna get the other piece first. Well, tell me how to do that. Other piece? What are you? you what are you smoking? There's a there's a teddy bear that you can get, and if you put it in this right place, it produces an even larger teddy bear. All right. I don't well, know. We need are to you, do are, this. Boy, are you on drugs? No, it is a real thing. No, I, I a, vaguely remember egg. this. I can't remember which vaguely other remember anything. I vaguely remember this. Well, you didn't destroy the. Okay, don't destroy these things. These things are important. Oh, that's right. It's up here. Very important things. That's where it is. Okay, how do I get up there? Uh, you go up here on the little things on the bottom. Got it. Oh, oh I got it. Got it. Got it. Okay, right. now we gotta set the set the teddy bear in a certain place. Where is it? I don't remember. I thought it was down there, actually. 
Because doesn't he come out of it the crane be. or something? Doesn't the crane like pick him up? Yeah, yeah, he comes out of the crane. Okay. No, it's up here. There it's it up is. Here. There it's is. up here. I oh, jeez. Well, the wait, wait, wait. I'm not entirely sure how to get up there, but that is where we need to be. Oh, man. Oh, man. How did we get up there? This looks like a, a likely one. Can you crouch jump? Oh, I see the teddy bear. That's, I, How do you get up there? <laughs> okay, hold on. Let's, let's <laughs> think about this logically for a second. Sound off in the comments below. There. How do we get up there? <laughs> Please, and don't be smart about know. it. <laughs> oh, I got up there for a second. For a brief second, I was up there. <laughs> for a brief moment, his ha -ha. hopes lifted. How did you do that? All right, Jotson. I jumped on that barrel over there, and then I run jumped up here. Oh! Oh, run mother! You. It worked! Just place the teddy bear! Place the teddy Hold bear! On. We gotta wait I'm for Dingo! Let's wait feeling. for him! Alright, now what did you run jump on? Okay. Ooh, what now? Jump on the electric jump barrel? Jump on the shock barrel, yeah, and the then shock run barrel. jump. And then run jump. Then you have to run jump up here. Yeah! Oh, why Why did that work? All right, every, I didn't even crouch. Everyone watched the weird. crane. Everyone watched the crane as Jotson okay. places the teddy I bear. I place the teddy. Teddy bear, teddy bear is placed. Alright. So he had placed the teddy bear. This is vitally important to the entire Borderlands story. Am I standing on the teddy now bear? Everyone right watch the crane. Yes. Yes, you are. You are standing on top of the teddy bear. <laughs> this is a very structurally sound teddy bear. Well, it was built by the very best Hyperion engineers. <laughs> Spare no expense. Oh, oh, that was a force field. <laughs> it is a force field. For a moment, it looked like Wait butter. Wait for it. Wait for it. The very best in Hyperion butter. Uh, that is, look at that. It's a giant that teddy bear. That is an bear. exceptionally large teddy bear. Now, here's the question. Is See? this a Jurassic Wasn't Park reference? It? Um. <laughs> yeah, the Lost World. No, expense? no, the Lost World. Jurassic, Jurassic Bear. No, it's see you know, the small I, I, one I, I, and the big one, one coming thing. out of the cargo hold. Yeah, I swear. I, I, do have to bring up one thing. I don't. I really don't want to have the Chris Pratt argument again. <laughs> I know. I do have to bring up one thing. I love. I love. 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 Crane games. Uh, the the you know the crane claw games. I love them. I will spend right all of my money on them. Where's the bear I'm going? I'm telling you right now. The way that that crane is holding that bear would never work. <laughs> How dare you be unrealistic? That is video going game to that is teddy going teddy to slip through. I am extremely upset that that would slip through. Where is it going? And now it now he's gonna put him in there, I guess. Something feels dirty about this. I would even say smarmy. <laughs> uh, smarmed all over the place. Um, okay, right, is that it? it? Okay, Do, doesn't it give us something? It gives us something. Nope. Dude, All right, okay. The satisfaction of watching the crane move around a giant teddy bear. Well, congratulations. That was, that was my day. That was my day. Hey, look at BA Fire Skag. You guys have fun Hooray. fighting. La la la. La la la. Ow, why, why is there fire? I just started grenading. A fire sky. I'm gonna sit up here at the top until these things are dead. I'm not crazy. Ow. You hurt me, grenade. I'm upset about that. You wound me, grenade. <laughs> I thought you were my friend, grenade. I thought you were my friend. And my lover. Grenades make terrible lovers. Oh yeah, they're terrible. But I mean, one can't they're contain one's shoes. own passions. <laughs> like that guy who's in love with his car. <laughs> and we don't mean that like you know the euphemistic sense where oh he just really enjoys being around his car. No, I mean like literally in love. Now, there is a guy who was on television. There's probably lots of guys, but there was one guy who was on television who has a, a sexual relationship with his car. Well, you don't. Can a car give consent? It's more of a fling. Can, 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 can a car give consent? <laughs> no, technically it is auto-rape. You, you can 
Um, you can get its motor revving. <laughs> it's Grand Rape Auto. <laughs> I played that game. You know, I just I, I feel like I feel like that, that that's something a car cannot do. It's not, I feel like a car give cannot consent? give consent. No, a car well, is a slave. I mean, You know, if you... cars have rights too. Yeah, seriously, where's the Union Army now? No, they hmm? they, they really don't. Like, they <laughs> really don't have rights, that's the thing. <laughs> Where is Al Sharpton? Where are you, Al? <laughs> well, they need an appropriate car spokesperson. Like Al Lexus. <laughs> Henry Ford? <laughs> You know, a car who just drives up whenever there's something that can give him money. He's like, hey, you know, <laughs> look that, at me. Now that I think about it, now that I think about it, I mean, Google is making its own self-driving car. Mm -hmm. But if we're going to make cars follow the same rules that humans have to follow on certain things, does that mean that the car's not able to drive itself until, until it turns 18? <laughs> well, do you yeah, have I mean, to the put the car on your insurance? First. Well, yeah, how else if is it car... going to drive? <laughs> well, no, no, I mean, like, so the car has to get its own license. Do you have to put it on your insurance? <laughs> I think the car that seems goes silly. under your insurance. I mean, you, you extend your insurance well, that's, to that's your what car. I mean. It's like, that's, that's what I'm talking about. Yeah, like, the thing is, though, you said that whenever the car breaks the rules, you have to ground it so that it learns. <laughs> Fiscal responsibility? If the car drives itself too late at night, does it need to call you, like, to let you know that it's okay and it's with friends? Well, I mean, hopefully, hopefully you do put that rule down for your car, or else your yeah. car is going to be very rebellious. Hopefully he's not hanging around with that city bus again. Come on. <laughs> car, are you I feel you like that Uber? was vaguely racist. I just... <laughs> what? <laughs> car, you're Ubering again, aren't you? You might be the next <laughs> Alcarvin. <Al -Karton. laughs> I told you about this. No, I don't know. It's just you're hanging out with that city bus again. It's just like, really? So people that live in the inner city are now automatically bad? You're assuming well, that people who live in the inner city the are the only ethnic? Or is it or is it people that are really bad because they've had a lot of people inside of them? In which case now <laughs> you're kink shaming. And we've already discussed that we should not kink shame. Hey, I'm hey, totally we're gonna go fine get the weapon stash? No. Hey, whoa, 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 whoa. No. We're gonna get the hidden It's in the waterfall, it's right here. But you know it's going so? to suck. They always <laughs> suck. I haven't picked up a new weapon since we left the pirate place because they well, all suck. You know what? They're not even weapons. They're they're mods, and they're not even good. So <laughs> you were correct. <laughs> there was one green. I picked it up. It's being sold now. For some reason, the developers with the weapons chest, they just defecate in them. They just throw in the cruddiest... <laughs> Worst weapons you it's, can it's think based, of. It's a, it's a loot table. It's based off a loot table. And you're right, they're not good, but... Like, they did, and that maybe that's an actual flaw with the game, but there is zero excitement when you see a weapons chest. Well, I enjoy them. <laughs> yeah, but that might be like that guy with his car. We <laughs> don't know that it's because of the content. I don't enjoy them in that well, way. Like, you, it's why their would curves. you insinuate that I do? It's their crazy chest curves. Why would you even make it sound like I do that with weapons chest? Hey, That's I'm not silly. saying that. It's your Borderlands character. Don't King Shane. Is it because, I come, from the, is it because I come from the city? <laughs> you don't. Weapons chest cannot give consent, Dingo. Yes, leave it alone. Stop caressing its arches <laughs> and its lock. <laughs> <laughs> um, so the oh, weapons this? chest can't give consent, but technically speaking, the vending machines could. That's true. Yes, but the vending machines are underage. <laughs> Didn't see that one what, coming, uh, did so you? So dogs, if it's like, <laughs> if it's like one year, if it's like one year equals seven years for dogs, what's the, what's the age on, like, what's the conversion ratio on, uh, vending machines? <laughs> uh, Were they there for uh, the beginning of classic code? What's the average code? lifespan of a vending machine? You know, I don't think that's, uh, I don't really think that that's one of the great mysteries that science has been contemplating. I personally wouldn't go anywhere near a vending, machine, vending machine that didn't at some point contain Surge, because obviously they're too young. 
It's one of those rippers. You might be a 90s, vending machine. They don't know. You might be a 90s vending machine if. <laughs> the next, the new BuzzFeed this, list. This this vending machine used to give out quarters uphill both ways. One weird trick to turn your vending machine on. Obama hates this. <laughs> <laughs> well, you just defined web as. <laughs> well, the, the thing don't, is, I don't the want to challenge to your vending machine. I was on trying to stab something else. Ah. Oh, it's a BA stalker. Pretty bad right Oh, now. wow. Gotcha. Um, there we go, I'm back. Alive? <laughs> Hooray, I think the bull loader actually killed that. I killed it, I was loader, invisible. I mean. Alright, super BA loader. Hey, look at the thing. Oh, Betty, Betty didn't see that coming. Ow. Sorry. Oh, I'm down. Shoot this loader. Oh, God. Ow. <laughs> Why was there no shooting at the small loader? I even I wounded him for you. Up. Now I'm using Kressler's right, I'm getting, body I'm as a shield. Cover. Hey, I do not consent to this. <laughs> Too late. Alright, he dead. That is hell, that dead. Is help rape. <laughs> Speaking of sexual assault, did you guys, uh... Did you guys see the <laughs> Columbia University? Nice segue. Oh, I'm serious. Yeah, well, very gentle segue. Um, sh 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 the segue will be over soon. Um, no, there was a uh, a girl at Columbia University who graduated, and she brought along her mattress that she uh, uh, yeah. claimed she was sexually assaulted on. And even though the uh, even though they specifically banned. Um, Oh man, we gunloader. Uh, even though they specifically banned heavy, heavy items, what I I don't know. Loot midget, go loot midget. Is there another one? Oh, he's still alive. Oh god, what is going on? An orange weapon. A hefty baby maker. Uh, oh jeez, there's another one. Justin, jeez. <laughs> oh, why did you open another one? <laughs> I didn't realize I was a fool. Please kill this thing. Now I've got to open that last box. This has to happen. Please don't. I Please have don't to open it. <laughs> Why? Why would you do this? Why are all the boxes full of loaders? Contained. They're so adorable. <laughs> Why were all the boxes full of loaders? I don't know, but that was the best day oh. of my life. All right. Is anyone gonna take this SMG? Cause I'm gonna take it if no one else is. If I mean, I would just take it to sell it. I would actually use it. Okay. Yeah. Go for so, it. So. All right. SMGs suck. No, not when you you're trying to put as many bullets as possible down range at once. For me, it's about quantity, not quality. All right, what were you saying about uh, somebody with a mattress waving it at a crowd? Oh, no, she didn't <laughs> wave it at a crowd. She brought it with her to her graduation ceremony. Um, apparently, it's been her uh, junior and senior art the like her art the she does some art studies, uh, some art degree. Anyway, point is, she uh, she was carrying it around as her project. Uh, just showing that, you know, you always carry the weight of what was done to you. Which, okay, cool, you know, um, but the problem with it is that there was, the, the police dropped the suit against the guy that she's accusing of the rape, said there was no evidence that he actually did it. Um, it's, it's, I don't know, it's kind of a really sticky situation, and it's, but she's released, like she's been saying that she's been saying the name of the guy like she's released he's a, a German dude and she's been spreading his name everywhere and now people are like threatening him with death and everything he graduated at the same time it was, it's pretty nuts and I'm without knowing sure how to feel about it without knowing any information really aside from what gets reported on the news it'd be hard for me to really have an opinion either way 
Right. Right. Well, I'm just saying that, you know, um, it, it's rough that he's still suffering repercussions from something that the police felt there wasn't enough evidence to accuse him of. Yeah, but at the same time, if he's actually guilty, then it's warranted. So without no, right, without really knowing, guilty, yeah, there be, there's not much. Wouldn't there be evidence? No, no, not necessarily. Certainly not a perfect I mean, system. It's well, but what happens to the what happens to the whole? To prove. Oh, here's the thing. Like, what happens to the whole? Is he by law? Guilty? Is he guilty? Well, but here's the no, thing. Bingo. Is he? It's by law. By law, is he guilty? No, by law, he's completely innocent. Okay, you're right. You're right. You're right. By law, he is innocent because he's not been proven guilty. However, do guilty people sometimes get off? Yes. No, that's kind of the thing. So, that's why I mean, you, it's impossible to have so opinion really, without actually knowing the truth, and without, you can't really do without that. Without knowing the situation, you can't. Well, it's still can't possible judge to have an way. opinion. Well, it's impossible for me to have an opinion. Right. I'll yeah. rephrase that. <laughs> I'm just commenting more along the fact that people automatically assume that he's that he's guilty. Well, yeah, it's definitely going to do damage to him. And if if it is something where he is in fact innocent, then it's it's uh, really tragic that he has to go through that. I mean, I mean, here's the thing. I mean, we had, for example, the um, the Casey Anthony trial. I mean, no, there were a lot of people who were completely convinced loader. that she was guilty. Yet by law, she's innocent. Yet there there are people out there who will argue with you to the end that she was guilty. Yeah, and I'm two of them. <laughs> <laughs> so, I mean, but if, if that's the yeah, case, but I mean, there was go, actual physical. Say she, but there was actual physical evidence. Hold on. No, there was no, no. According to the law, evidence. according to the law, according she to the law, found, she, she, was she was she was acquitted. She was acquitted. Although she was found so guilty therefore, of lying by, to by the, the police. The same, I can judge her. By, she by was the found same guilty definition, of lying by the same definition, I can the judge her for lying to the police. That you're judging that other person. You, you can judge her for lying to the police, but you can't call her a murderer. I mean, by in the your, Bible, by it definition. says that all sins uh, by in the Bible it says that all sins are equivalent. So is that? in God's eyes, she's just as bad. All <laughs> sin is a sin. All sin is sin. Where is that though? Well, but you can't. Call the only her one. The I hear only that one a that's lot. Actually mentioned as being the only one that's actually mentioned as being worse is uh, blasphemy against the Holy Spirit. No, but where does it say that? You, I'm not saying that it doesn't. I just I've, I'm that gets quoted a lot without a reference. I don't know. Probably the apocryphal. <laughs> <or something. laughs> right. It's it, it's in the book of laminations. <laughs> the book <laughs> of lamination is hard to read because it's so shiny. <laughs> <laughs> but if you, it's okay. You don't you don't have to worry about it if you spill something on it. That's right. It, it yeah, cannot be damaged. Right off. <laughs> it's actually it's actually an allegory for uh, the cleansing of sin. Wait, so once laminated, always laminated. Is that the same as once saved, always saved? <laughs> I did have a, uh, I had a biology textbook uh, when I was in high school that had, because it was supposed to be used in a lab setting, it had laminated pages, and I could not read that thing. You had to basically cover it with an umbrella. <laughs> it's so slick. <laughs> it's so slick. And, and also, as you turn the pages, it made this horrible <laughs> noise because it was squeaking on your fingertips. It was terrible. That sounds great, honestly. <laughs> that I was had so much fun with that. <laughs> Everyone, please turn to the Book of Zipthar, Chapter 4. <laughs> the Book of Zipthar <laughs> says, Glub Glub. Glub Glub Bubble. Glub 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 Glub. <laughs> I like how he says bubble. <laughs> well, the bubble is a visual thing, but you have to represent it some way. Now, in the official translations, <laughs> the it literally a shows a picture of a bubble. <laughs> so, hold on. Time out. Um... If a dip or not a diphthong, if a what is it, an onomatopoeia, is the verbal representation of a, a like of a an auditory sound, like clomp. A clomp yes. is an onomatopoeia, right? Yes. Right. So what is a um like written interpretation of an action, but not not a verb. I mean like bubble, like something that someone has created. The sound of someone creating something. I think it's still just an onomatopoeia. But that's different. It's not. At least I think it's different. I don't know. I'm playing video games. I don't have time for. 
Well, and also, I mean, you can never make the assumption that language is comprehensive when it comes to logical connections. Right, but if it's if it's if we are identifying a flaw in the language, then shouldn't we also be responsible for cleaning up the mess, so to speak, and finding a way to fix it? Uh, if, if you'd like to, I think you have to care. I would love to. <laughs> Let's do that now. Well, I mean, you uh, by all means, make it happen. Open a blog. Words we need. I think they already have those, but it's always stupid stuff like. Um, Oh, what's the one I saw? The sarcastic mark. It's a uh, a punctuation mark that always shows whenever you're being sarcastic. Kind of defeats the purpose. Well, <laughs> if you're being if you're being sarcastic for the for the comedic effect, and you're trying to do it through text, that's very very difficult. Well, just don't be sarcastic. <laughs> but that's pretty much all I've got. <laughs> oh. Are you a Holden Caulfield type I character? Myself, I shroud myself in a cloak of sarcasm and cynicism to belie my hollow and empty nature. Sounds well, like Holden The important Holden thing is that we finally got rid of the Oxford comma. Excuse you? <laughs> you want to go? Dino, it's easy. You want to go? <laughs> <laughs> you want to do this? We can do this. Oh god, you ever, <laughs> the grenades flew everywhere. <laughs> you ever dance with the devil in the pale moonlight? Jack Nicholson, obviously the worst of the Jokers. Get out! <laughs> <laughs> you are being intentionally antagonistic, and I do not appreciate it. <laughs> That's good. I'm only being a bit of a troll. Well, there's only really two things I hate. Uh, Starship Troopers and the Dark Tower series. <laughs> guys are terrible. <laughs> <laughs> we're missing a, a, a sample. Oh, we are? Yeah, we're missing a sample. I don't like missing things. It's up here. Oh, he there. found it. He got it. Oh, thank God. We all good. <clears throat> um, what's the other uh, one that we have going on right now? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Well, if it's something we have to do, we have to backtrack. This one, oh, oh, wait, it's okay. over here. Never mind. It's over here. Okay. Yeah, that's why I was saying we're at the end, so we probably need to figure out what the problem is. What the dealio. Things to shoot. I was All on the, the wrong things. side of the map. That is an shoot awesome all grenade. the things. It was great. You're a tribute to our team. My grenade is. And don't forget, we're lovers. I hear a lot of screaming. <laughs> Digger, Digger, come back. What? There was a green that needed to be grabbed. It was begging me. Pick me up, Dingo. Pick me up. <laughs> Jotham's trying said, to kill himself. <laughs> it did I hurt said, a little. Don't worry, baby. Is this my favorite part of the game? I think this might be my favorite part. Of the game. <laughs> I believe it is. Uh, I wonder who we could be fighting. Oh man, this might be a surprise. What is that? What could that possibly be? Wait, She's a like, monster! Oh no! <laughs> You're a monster! <laughs> <laughs> oh, Bloodwing. How I hate thee. Okay, I shot it and it did nothing. <laughs> That's what she said? I see feathers falling out. No health is leaving. What's up? What's up? Oh, we boy. have to get rid of. We have to wait for everyone to get done talking. This is stupid. Oh face. dear. Yeah, this makes me all. This makes me all sad pants. That still didn't hurt her. There. Ah, there we go. There we go. He is fire. Go Worthington. What, she. She is fire. She is death. 
She has really bad breath. It's a poem by Johnson. I have 200 stacks of anarchy. <laughs> Just fire so wildly. Anarchy. <laughs> you will regret dragging Bloodwing into this, Jack. Everybody, take it easy. Don't kill it too hard. <laughs> it's fine. Everything's fine. I know we're clearly <laughs> overpowered, but let's pretend like this is difficult. Oh no, got health um. back. Ah. Okay. Oh, there, there's the... Is Bloodwing supposed to do anything, as in attacking us? Um, there we go. Okay. Oh yay! We saved Bloodwing. Quick, Bloodwing. Right, she's right there. We know. We know. Look, look. Take <laughs> off the. Take off the thing. Take off the thing. We're right here. We know what's about to happen. <laughs> yay! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, ready See, for a KFC right, bucket. Now, yeah, I we was can about to say it. Now, we can I fix mean, it. This, this would feed everyone <laughs> in in Sanctuary. <laughs> I'm just saying. Oh, man. Oh, wait, I absolutely love that. All we need to do is put a tourniquet. If we put a tourniquet <laughs> on the <laughs> neck, we'll save her. <laughs> Anybody got some chest paddles? <laughs> we can fix Stons this. the blood flow. I'm pretty sure if anybody could, Zed could. I mean, he's he's probably pretty good about stuff like that. Well, I've learned from Battlefield 2 that if you have some chest paddles, bullet holes, and decapitations are nothing. Mean nothing. Someone could literally slice your throat, and as long as you get shocked a couple times, you are fine. <laughs> There's a purple. There's a purple. There's a couple purples over here. Poiple. 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 All right. Oh, that's actually that's a pretty cool pistol. Uh, Let's see how it compares to my pistol. Take which it. Is a pretty good pistol. Oh, it's actually better. It's actually better than my pistol. Take it. 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 Oh my goodness! It looks like I'm holding some kind of bulbous tumorized gun. Tumorized. Tumorized. Now that's a word you'll have to look up because it doesn't exist. Things, stuff, stuff, events. Dying birds. Although it's fine, we've already discussed that bird was actually a robot this whole time. <laughs> Bloodwing! <laughs> Bloodwing was pretty real. I mean, when the head went missing, blood was everywhere. It was just a robot head. <laughs> you know, that actually takes away some of the fun of watching him die, so I reject that. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone knows that birds are robots because obviously living things can't fly. <laughs> it is ridiculous. And bats are just demons. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, bugs are, are robot spies for the government. <laughs> well, duh. I mean, that's. I read the blaze. Pretty accurate. There are tons of sniper rifles around here. Yeah, I noticed. <laughs> Anyone who's ever heard Glenn Beck knows that insects are spies from the government. <laughs> Anyone who's ever heard Glenn Beck probably needs to have their upper ret like their upper fatty epiglottis removed. Why the epiglottis? That's so crucial. I don't know. That was just the first. That was just the first word that popped into my head. It Everything they eat is going to fall into their lungs, Dingo. Do you? Do you? Want that? What kind of death is that? It wouldn't actually be a death. It would just be uncomfortable. Oh, uh, the first time you had a drink, you would die. No, you just gotta lean forward. Instantly. <laughs> Instantly. Or is it back? I don't know. It's one of the two. You either have to lean forward or backward. You have things to turn in. The epiglottis is the unsung hero of the throat. Oh, 
Crescent Great. has dinged. Great. I'm not even near dinging. <laughs> bet he was cheating. I bet he was. Crestliff, give me tips on dinging. Is it excessive cheating? <laughs> I have to cheat all the time. Every time. All day. Uh, every day. More anarchy. Alright, I think we got time for another mission. Wait, don't we? we got time for another mission? Let's I'm turn in the. Let's see, they gotta turn another one, so we have to. Oh, we gotta do torture chairs. Let's go. Let's go get torture chairs done. Oh, that's actually here in Sanctuary, I think. Oh, this is a quick and easy one. It is. Are we gonna listen to the full recordings, or are we gonna no, just goodness, run and no. grab They're, them? Just grab them. They are pretty. In, they are pretty fun. Oh, I think it forces us to listen to them. I was gonna force us to. No, if you collect them, though. Well, I saw one, and it, it's not here anymore. Or did I already pick it up? Uh, I think it was picked up. I'm gonna go grab this one in the very far corner. I'm grabbing the one in Zed's. Alright, well I will grab... There's one with Claptrap. Mm, I'll... Oh, it's with Claptrap? Alright, I'll grab the one with Claptrap then. <laughs> Yay! That was simply the best mission. Oh, and then I turned in the thing to Claptrap. Sorry. And he's doing his weird thing where he turns invisible. Hey, XP is XP. <laughs> well, that was actually a mission one. Sorry. That's aight. Aight. Oh. Now I gotta turn that into Roland. Hmm. Ooh, 7,000 XP. I dinged. I also did ding. <laughs> I also had things happen. Hmm. Yes, good. 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 Oh, we have another mission down here. It's we have scooter. many, many more missions. Now we have another mission in here. Most of these missions everywhere. Oh God! Most of these missions seem to be busy work. Give me something to kill. <laughs> that's not wildlife. That part was pretty dull. <laughs> I think that's. Is this? Oh yeah, this one's kind of funny. Yeah, but that one's actually in the. The cavern. Let's go ahead and get the so no, 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 anonymous it? done. No, 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 no. Uh, is this? I think this might be the one that's actually here in in sanctuary. It's telling us to leave. No, no, no. This is the point. No, no, it's not. It's 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 in thousand cuts. Yeah, it's, it's telling us to leave. Nope. Crapola. Oh yeah. Let's do Rackaholics. Rackaholics is in the dust. The dust. Uh, okay. <laughs> Just got his opinion on the dust. Well, switch the mission so I can. Not a fan. So I can teleport. All right, I'll do it. On. Uh, Rackaholics. Well, I tried to kill Kressler. I'm sorry to say it. <laughs> And I've been thinking about it for weeks. It's all right. Man. Most people do try to kill me. <laughs> I look at some point or another. Um. So let's. Since we're in the dust, let's talk about something thematically appropriate. Uh, has anyone seen the new Mad Max film yet? I have not. I have, and it was amazing. It was really fun. I actually watched the original Mad Chris, Max last night because I'm getting Chris, ready. Did you actually say that? Uh, didn't you actually say that it was basically Borderlands the movie? Uh, actually, you'd have to say that Borderlands is basically Mad Max the game. <laughs> Especially this <laughs> What's area. the difference between the two? Uh, one, you're searching for treasure, and the other is just a basically a guy trying to survive. Survival is the treasure. 
So, wait, was, was this the first time you'd seen the original Mad Max? Yes, it was. Him? I've never seen any of the films. So I'm just What'd trying to get caught it? up. Uh, it was definitely interesting. It was not as apocalypsy as I expected. And it was also not as uh, action-heavy. I mean, it had a lot of character stuff to it, and it actually had some pretty tragic moments. Uh, overall, I'd say I liked it, but it wasn't, like, mind-blowing. Um, Thunderdome's much more actioning. That's the third one. Is that the third one? Yeah. The second one yeah, I've heard is much more action-y as well. <laughs> Two men enter, one man leave. What are we doing? Are we supposed to, like, kill we're that thing? It doesn't seem to get hurt. No, we're supposed to do... I don't know, I thought we were supposed to do damage to it. Yeah, oh, wait, drop the keg. Pick up drop the kegs. kegs. Got it. Isn't it also, like, if you get too close to the thing, it will literally kill you? Yeah, if it hits you, you die. What, the keg of moonshine? No, the actual vehicle. Yeah, it's like the, uh, it's like the caravan. Because the caravan can instantly kill you as well. Oh my Oh god! Jeez! <laughs> you boosted. I did boost, and he did didn't boost enough. Just... Why did that suddenly get really loud in my headphones for some reason? <laughs> because it hates you. That was really strange. Oh God. Yeah, it's getting really noisy. Must just be a glitch on this <laughs> particular mission. How do we make it drop kegs? We got to get to shoot it with uh, bullets. Oh, shoot it with bullets. Okay. Shoot it with all. I hadn't even using it's the bullets. He's a runner for this one, actually. There's a there's a keg. Okay, now that I'm shooting it as well, it seems to be going better. Another keg. Where did it go? Where did it go? Did I lose it? <laughs> I don't know. We have yeah, a mission. Just follow the diamond. We have a mission here. Just mission. Just follow the diamond. G go get the mission. I'll get the final I keg, and we can all get out of here because we all hate the dust. I like it. Hey, who are we riding with? I'm riding, riding with Johnson. Johnson. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Did you not notice how crafty my driving was? It was crafty. Oh, it's Steve! You remember Steve? Johnson? Steve! It's Steve! Hello! Does he have a job for us? Get it? Steve Jobs? Ho oh, ho! Oh, we have to go, uh. We have to go destroy the, um. the things and the stuff. Oh, I love those. Oh, we should arrive at night, maybe? Oh, don't worry, it will change tonight. Uh, if you want to wait. Oh, that's I right, it doesn't change tonight. Kill the buzzard. It's a BA buzzard, it needs to die. <laughs> I'm shooting at it, but it's not doing much. <laughs> Go, Death Trap! <laughs> Only you can prevent buzzards. Oh, I actually hit it with a TD over weapon. As in throwing it? I feel special now. Yeah. Oh, are we actually... Hold on. I Got forgot. It. We're actually doing this right now, aren't we? Carrying very valuable ornaments over here. I don't know. Oh, that's an actual bandit technical. I thought it was some an, a friend. I thought it was someone <laughs> I knew. <laughs> Is that Gary? <laughs> Gary, what are you doing here? Gary. That's not Gary. Those are enemies. Gary. <laughs> looking Gary. like enemies. Gary, why are you dressed up like an enemy, Gary? There you are, you little punk. Where are we going? Where's that the moonshiners? I'm just having a blast the driving. Are, those are still the moonshiners. Where's the oh, caravan? No, not, here. not like this. <laughs> There's the caravan. Yeah. Come here, caravan. Are, I am living why life. Why are we looking for the caravan? This is going to have terrible Oh, no, weapons. you guys. No, no, no. You guys do caravan. Or I'll do I'll do caravan. You guys 
Go do the Hodunk stuff. Alright, let's go do the Hodunk. Let's go do the Hodunk stuff. I was hoping it would turn night, but it didn't. Oh, you get right, better weather reasons. Think I was you kinda... park your car in front of the caravan when you rob it. Yeah. <laughs> He's done that, that was before. that was pretty they, clever. I totally before. believed him for a minute. <laughs> I was like, "Ooh, a Borderlands secret! Wait a minute." <laughs> All right, I'll turn them on if you hit them with fire. Oh, I need fire. Okay, well, let me find something with fire. Let's do that. For, oh, oh, no, no. Okay. I don't remember how to use this menu. <laughs> it's been so long. <laughs> well, step one is parking a fr a tr a, um, your technical in front of the caravan as you <laughs> rob it. It's true. I mean, you should definitely do that. <laughs> that is thing one. Uh oh, the ho dunks are angry. I thought we had finished up this little on. civil war thing. Well, apparently, we had. It's never over. It won't be over until spoilers. We go to one of my least favorite um, dungeons in the game. You know, I I feel like you just hate this game overall, Bingo. <laughs> <laughs> I'm I'm slowly getting there. You're uh, you're harping on it today. Usually you're not, but today yeah. you are. I'm just in a bad mood, I guess. You need a pop tart. Pop tarts fix everything. Mostly because they give you such horrible indigestion, you can't think about anything else. <laughs> shoot it! 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 All right, all right. Guys, As I tell my daughter, say it one it time, one time. You also told me that last time. Shoot it's on my mind. Shoot I like how you said say it one time. One. But you said that twice. <laughs> yeah, and I've realized that <laughs> say when, it one time twice. When I'm talking to her, when I'm telling her to do something, I typically tell her multiple times because she's not paying attention. So I'm I'm pretty much right, defeating my own purpose. You, yeah, I was about to say, <laughs> do as I say, not as I do. You're, yes. you're literally teaching her the opposite. I I will not deny that I am a highly hypocritical parent. Hey, caravan. That's you should totally ram the caravan. That's how, that's how, you, that's how you stop it. Ah! <laughs> oh god, it didn't work! It didn't work! You're one of those people. <laughs> oh, come on, I want to hit the buzzer. Someone's, your in my, someone's in my turret. When am I, why did you get my turret? Because <laughs> my car did, got destroyed thanks to some bad advice. Hey, look, a technical. You just didn't do it. Are we are we going? Oh jeez! <laughs> <laughs> the moonshiner just ripped it's the through moon here. Shiner. It's the it's the moonshiners. Stuff is extremely loud. You need to get that checked. I don't think that's EPA regulatory. <laughs> no. no, that's that's well, definitely Well, they a live problem. in an agricultural area. No, they live in an agricultural area. It's fine. They probably have the green diesel and everything. It's cool. Are we turning this in? Okay. Oh. No, That's what I'm trying to go do. I thought you wanted to leave. Well, we can't leave until we turn this in. Oh, yeah, we had to turn it into Steve. Sorry, I was thinking Ellie. Just out of habit. But does Steve have a job? <laughs> oh! Well, Steve's a terrible person because his name is Steve. Oh, did you, either of you guys see the trailer for the new Steve Jobs movie? No, I haven't. You didn't? With, um, I know you just told. I know you just told me about this the other day. Did I? Yeah, it's Michael not the Fassbender. Kutcher, though, right? Like that one's already gone. Yeah, oh. this is Michael Fassbender. Does he bend faces? I don't know. We can ask him. I'd love to. He actually seems like he'd be a pretty cool guy. He does. He does. La 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 la. Oh, we're doing more of these. Okay. No, we can. Teleport. Let's do it. We can. I just, um, all I know is I want to spend yeah, as sure. much time in the dust as I can. I just love it here. Uh. It's so pretty. The wonderful forest. I got twelve dollars. I got twelve dollars. You're very proud of that, aren't you? <laughs> 
Well, I mean, what else am I going to do in this battle other than collect dollars. money? Alright, there's another mission okay. here. Just ram into the guy, he'll still give you the mission. <laughs> Come on! Come on, he's in a wheelchair. He's the Professor X of this game. <laughs> So, this game tries, this game series does a lot to try and break stereotypes, and by doing so, I suppose, bring more equality. Um, like, it doesn't have the oversexified girls on, and then on some characters, it has an extremely oversexified female. Um, but it, it, it really plays with stereotypes. But do you feel. Like, there's any stereotype or any group that this uh, this game series plays with or messes around with where they're just all over the top mean to? Like, just consistently, consistently belittling to? <laughs> you, you're, you're, you're not very Doctors. subtle with this attempt to make your point. <laughs> what? <laughs> I said doctors. Uh, doctors, you're, they are just you're right, ruthless. Doctors, doctors <laughs> absolutely. They are very terrible with doctors. Um, I'm also going to say... Um, They're not very nice to poor people. <laughs> How's that? I, I'm going to say... I'm gonna say robots. They're they're very... You know, they're not doing much for the robot community. They, they love birds. What are you talking about? One of the one of I'm the about major the side characters. Robot. One of the major side characters in this game was a robot. George. I'm talking well, you, about Bloodwing. Are you talking about Claptrap? No, I'm talking well, no, about Bloodwing. No, no, Bloodwing was in the first game. He was barely in this game. The one time you see him, he was a bad guy. Uh, she. Thank you. She was she. a bad guy. Lo robots don't have gender. Mo uh, they used Birds to refer to him as he. Don't have gender. Uh, and it <laughs> We've been over this. They, rep they reproduce asexually. <laughs> what are we doing? What are we doing? I'm trying guys? to figure out how to do well, this. Well, we have to drink the loggers. Why are we drinking? Why not? We have to drink loggers. Oh, no, 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 I'm no, no. We ale. don't want to do that. We don't want to do that because if we do that, we have to go do the mission because it's timed. Oh, that's right, it is. Don't do that one right now. We're not going to finish up the boar? Nah. But what are we going to do? Everything else is in the uh, thousand cuts. Okay, if we uh, do that, that's not no, no. a. That, yeah, we'll, oh, we'll bring it to we'll do this. Don't, do we want to take, don't it? take it to Mordecai. Because Mordecai Why? gives you a doll sniper rifle. Do you want oh, a doll boy. sniper rifle? <laughs> <laughs> I do. Do you want ants, Michael? Do you, do you want, want ants, ants Lana? This is how we get ants. This is how we get ants. I got an expeditious ruby. Why did I get a ruby that was not incendiary? What the heck? Well, I got a Miss Moxie's ruby, which is a <clears throat> corrosive weapon. We travel. Yeah, what? Why are we getting? It is not nearly as good as the one I already have. That is sad. I do like the. Uh, I do like the flavor text for this. I don't feel like we. I don't. I don't feel like we have to go to thousand cuts. Yeah, no, no, we don't want to do that. Let's just end it. We're ending it. Yeah, it's been. Guys, it's probably been a while. Um, yeah, Justin McReady is dead. <laughs> no. Oh, we're in the ballpark oh, of an hour, no. so let's just wrap it up. <laughs> All right. Um, hey guys, we're back. We're back. We're back. We're back. We're back. This is this is our welcome back thing. We're done with school, so we should be back on a regular schedule from here on out. Uh, let's not say things will regret oh, later. Jots Johnson is. He, th th I have respect for Justin McReady, Johnson. <laughs> Necrophilia. Thanks, it's a thing. It's a thing. It, his name is Reddy. It, it's spelled <laughs> like Reddy. It's, I'm pretty sure it's McCready. <laughs> Just in. He's Reddy. <laughs> he's he's Mick Reddy. I am McLovin. All right. Oh, babe. So. I'm not even going to plug the social, because I don't feel like it. Um, <laughs> well, that <laughs> seems rather anti-social of you. Buzzing. You do you. So, yeah, um, so, Borderlands, we are very disappointed in your stereotyping of robots that, that offends us as robots. And doctors. I mean humans. And I robot totally doctors. totally human. <laughs> no, the robot doctors are the worst. So, <laughs> for Grizzled Beagle playthroughs, this is Kreslov. This is uh, probably Dookie Dingo. I don't know. Something. And this is Jotsam.
no existential and crisis we here. Hope, <laughs> we hope you guys had as much fun watching as we did playing. Beep boop, what is love? Beep boop, beep boop. Call! Alright. I'm leaving this world. Is that your, is that your robot call? <laughs> yeah, it was. Well, he said beep boop, and he's, of course that means robot, so... That's gonna wrap up with a call. <laughs>